Do you know nice. who that is? Do you know him? <laughs> no. Do this. She said she wants to place the statue right here. Mm -hmm. Of you? <laughs> of me? <laughs> That's the romantic area. This is where you'll see me with my future husband. bunch of little kids, some teenagers and some elders. Her father actually owns this property and donated it to the ESHU. There were city lots, lots that we could have asked for, but we felt like there are so many people who own private land that they're not doing anything with. We're actually hoping that this will send a ripple effect out into the community. It's actually an interesting. This is the space. Yeah. And it says here the big circle here in the ground is from a year we want to have here. I don't know. A year ago. So that we will find out. I think we can find out. All these people built this part. Water. Oh, there's, wa there's a water system? Oh, perfect. Are we good? 
Good. Hi, how are you? Hello, I'm her cousin. I'm going. Oh, I'm nice. Going. She's giving us a, a tour of the spiritual garden. Yeah. Okay. We, we want to build a greenhouse there. A garden? Yep. Well, I certainly can use some maintenance. Yes. We already uh, started growing plants. Well, she's giving it a good foot up, so I don't anticipate that you folks will have uh, much difficulty filling her dream. <laughs> nice meeting you. Yes. How you doing? Come on through. Come on through. Thank you. Hi there. How are you today? Very well. What's up? Your favorites. Oh, okay. Questions. This is what you're using. Number four. We have a giant butterfly sculpture. We are erecting ion the reflection area with the pillars. Ooh. Oh. Nice. This is Very so nice. cool. I know. I love this. Can someone take a picture of this? This is yep, legit. I'm, I'm I want this in my apartment. <laughs> like on my wall. <laughs> on the ceiling. On the ceiling. Oh. On the ceiling. Oh. Legit, I want one of these here. Okay. That is so cool. Get a good picture. Get a good picture. I want that. <laughs> <laughs> it's so bad. Ryan, take you on yours. Alright, come on, you guys. So it's, uh, what, this is Kempton Street, off of Kempton, so yep. then it's at the intersection of Emerson. And this is, this is can also go in the sacred garden space in a here where the teepee used to be. Oh yeah. But it, yeah. But it blew away. So blueberry bushes? So a teepee used to be here. And it blew away. This number six? The, yeah. Mm -hmm. The greenhouse can also go in the sacred green space and it's here where it's oh the teepee used to be. Why is there no more teepee? Hurricane Sandy? Blew it away. Just make it again. I like cheese. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Hurricane Sandy took my hook back. <laughs> <laughs> we have these vegetable garden plots. Yeah, and you have a. This is Used for the community. But the water is over there. Oh, sure. Is there another water? Yeah, there's a water <laughs> <She's>, yeah. <laughs> okay, so what's the first question that we have? First question that Ryan can Why? Oh, why have you named the location a uh, spiritual warrior? How would a sustainable greenhouse impact the space?
How many people use this space? Do you know? Do you guys keep track? How did you come across the space or become the maintainer of the garden? Do you think, um, it must be probably like maintaining this, right? And keeping up with all, it must be a lot of work. Coming off like a realistic standpoint, what about like money and financial needs, like say to build the greenhouse? <laughs> yeah. Say, well, we no. found out that we can get <laughs> free wood. Like, where was that place? This, we found our teacher told us we can get free wood. We we've been collecting. I've been collecting bottles and stuff like that. Yeah. To make like and I also started to plant flowers for the recycled greenhouse. Okay. All right, so research on Here. <laughs> Coconut water. Mm -hmm. I want to sit here and hang out. Alright, we ready? 